and eat together on the same table. You understand what I'm saying? They can't even share an idea together. When one thinks this way, they can't even have the same mind on something. You understand what I'm saying? And so I started to realize that the reason why we are still having trouble and wars within the body of Christ and the things that we're dealing with, especially in the Christian faith, is because we have not come to a certain relationship. We've not understood what this does to this. What this does to this. You understand what I'm saying? I was dealing with a couple recently and I was counseling them. And uh, somebody is disturbed because their husband does not listen to them. And then they are waging war with their husband because he's not listening to them. And I tell her, but your husband is born again. Isn't it? And he is. And the scriptures say that the head of every man is what? Christ. And the head of every woman is a man. So I told her, could it occur to you that maybe your husband does not listen to you because you don't know how to talk to his God? You don't know how to speak to his master. Because you can think that he's just refusing to listen to you. But if Christ is his head, if truly Christ is his head, you understand what I'm saying? That's why Peter speaks of that chaste conversation, which is of the incorruptible and meek, that gentle spirit, which in the eyes of God is what? It's priceless. That without the words, the Bible says, you may win them over with your chest conversation. That the most disciplined soul in a woman knows how to speak without speaking. That's how Sarah deals with her husband when he refuses to get rid of Hagar. I was sharing with my wife recently and I told her, look at every Christian woman that has kept her marriage. They have knees. They have praying knees. Every Christian woman that has kept her marriage has praying knees. I was raised by a Christian woman. I saw how my mother prayed. Somebody shout hallelujah. He does this, she goes on her knees. He does this, she goes on her knees. Because long ago, people were told.